The bipod is a relatively new piece of equipment that we've been able to get in the nutrition and dietetics department. And basically what it does is measure the amount of calories that a person is burning at rest, which is a really important number to know, but it also tells you the percent of body fat and lean tissue or muscle tissue in the body. We acquired both bod pods um, about a year ago and ours actually came because of the flagship funding for the Department of Nutrition and Dietetics. We wanted to have this cutting edge piece of equipment so that we could use it in research and so ours is located in a lab in the College of Health building and the other one is actually over in our Student Wellness Center so that all of the students can take advantage of this new technology. The research that we're conducting with the bod pod is uh, taking students self-estimated caloric expenditure and body composition, so their body fat percentage versus what the bod pod actually measures. The bod pod is the new gold standard in uh, body composition analyzing, so uh, it's been interesting to see what students think they are and their caloric expenditure versus what's actually measured. A person would do when they come in is they first um, fill out and sign a informed consent, then they do the 24-hour food recall. Um, then they would change into their outfit, which would be like a skin-tight lycra outfit. They would put on a swim cap um, because the since the bod pod does measure air displacement, they would um, need to wear as minimal or as close to their skin as possible. And so they would enter into the bod pod and it would using the computer through some simple steps, it would measure their body composition and their percent body fat to their percent fat-free mass. This is the wave of the future to have these precise measurements and so when they go to work in a hospital or some of them may work in sports nutrition where this is being used more currently um, to look at athletes because the more muscle that an athlete has and the lower fat um, they carry, the more strength they have and so for all kinds of sporting events this is a really important measure and so our students will be able to go into those venues know how to use the machine know what the results mean and be able to counsel people in terms of what that means for their nutritional status and and how they should change their diet so the equipment and technology like the bod pod it's been really great opportunity of really enjoyed it it's cutting edge technology that only a few places here in Jacksonville have and being able to use something like this has been a great opportunity for me. It gives me experience with the latest technology, it gives me an edge over my peers because I have that research and volunteer experience. Because of the flagship funding, we've been able to purchase equipment like the Bod Pod, and that was actually written into the flagship application. Um, our master's program is going online to try to reach more um, professionals out there who were registered dietitians who didn't happen to have a master's. And for our profession, in the next few years, the master's will become the entry level. So that master's degree being widely available through distance learning is going to help us reach out to those professionals who want to obtain a master's degree to help them stay at the top level of their profession. And the other thing that we were able to write into that application was the creation of the second doctorate of clinical nutrition in the country. And that's so exciting for us. It takes us to a higher level of education, research, experience, and we're so looking forward to starting that program in 2015.